guys, it's Nikki. Happy Monday once again. Like my shirt? Yeah. It's actually a hoodie. I don't know why I said shirt. I've had a very crazy day. <laughs> so this week, our topic is religion and the LGBT community. Does it mix? Why or why not? And do you think that it's justifiable to discriminate against LGBT people based on religion? Why or why not? Now, the second part of that question is very obvious, I think, for me. <laughs> um, but I'm not going to speak for everyone else. I will see what people say. But I will start with the first part, which is, do religion and LGBT community mix? I actually don't think so. And I will tell you why. There was a time when I was what you would call <laughs> perhaps maybe a Jesus freak. Just a little bit. I call my yay God phase. And I went through that uh, for most of my high school career. And I almost joined like a Christian cult. It was very interesting. I'm not gonna go into all of that. And maybe on my personal channel, I'll maybe do a, um, a description of that at one point. But that's not what this video is gonna be about. I, I thought that I believed in God and I was Christian and you know, all that good stuff. However, as I got to college and I started to be able to think for myself and discover things for myself, I realized one, who I was, and I found out that I was bi, and two, I started realizing that religion did not mix with who I was. And I'll explain that by saying that most organized religion in this country, especially the major religions, and when I say major religions, I'm talking about Christianity, Islam, Judaism, and Hinduism. Those are the four. Now, I don't know a lot about Hinduism, but I know about the main three, and homosexuality is definitely looked upon as a sin in most of those religions, and I'm not saying everybody who is a part of those religions thinks that way, but it is heavily preached in my experience that homosexuality is wrong and LGBT members are to repent for their sins and change their lifestyle to fit what the Bible or their religion says about how they should live their lives. So I, for one, have this feeling that, for one, I'm not a religious person. I have a big thing against religion and I am an atheist. I should mention that, I'm an atheist. But I, I consider myself a spiritual atheist and if you wanna know more about that, feel free to ask me. I just don't think that religion has any positive influence. And I feel that every time something bad has happened as far as wars and things of that nature, religion has been a big part of it. So I, for one, am very against religion. And so because of that, I don't think that religion and homosexuality mix. And I also have the feeling that if somebody doesn't like me or who I am, then I don't want to be a part of their group. If a certain group says that, you know, I don't like your kind, why would I want to be part of that? I really, you know, and I'm not, and again, I'm not saying it's everyone, but I'm saying that there is a general theme in, in Christianity, Islam, and Judaism that homosexuality is wrong, and I don't want to be a part of some somebody who thinks that I'm wrong. So, <laughs> that's my opinion on that piece. Now the second part, do I think that religion is a good excuse to be discriminatory against people in the LGBT community? No. <laughs> I don't think that. I think that when people use that as an excuse, it really is to cover up the fact that they were already that way and now this is a reason, they're using religion as a reason to hide behind for how they feel. And I, what I mean by that, because that kind of sounded <laughs> in my ears, it sounded out loud a lot more confusing than it sounded in my head, but what I mean by that is I feel that people are bigoted, plain and simple. And I think that a lot of people will discriminate against people and use religion as an excuse for that and hide behind that as an excuse. Because like I said, I know people, plenty of people who are religious who don't have that same feeling. So, you know, I think that I don't think it's an, a good excuse, you know, and I don't think that people should be discriminatory, period. I have lots of friends, like I said, who are religious and who love me for who I am and love other people who are LGBT for who they are. So I don't wanna hear that crap about, oh, religion is why I'm discriminatory against LGBT people. No, that's called you're a bigot and you need to take responsibility for it. So anyway, 
I love you guys so much. And I'm looking forward to seeing what the other allies think. What do you think? Leave a comment below or post something on our Facebook page and let us know um, what you think about religion and LGBT. Does it mix? And maybe share some stories with us on the Facebook page. Video responses will be good if you want. And hopefully I will see you guys next week. <laughs> All right. Bye.